What is going on guys, Rubio Gaming 17 here, back with part 3 of Resident Evil 7. Welcome back to the continuation. Hopefully y'all y'all are having a good day so far. Or a great weekend. Depending on when this video goes up. <laughs> but thank y'all so much for tuning in. Glad y'all can be here. And we're back in our save room here. <clears throat> As you would recall from last time, we did something crazy. We uh, basically decided to take Jack head on. Oh, here's Grandma. Creepy, creepy Grandma. We decided to take Jack head on without a... all molded in here right and we decided to take jack head on without getting the shotgun so we just pretty much fought him with a handgun and as you would all recall it just took me a knife pretty much beat him nope wrong key uh there was a treasure here that i need to pick up Steroids, I believe that increases your max health. Yep, lasts indefinitely, so we're gonna use that. And before we progress through the rest of the game, I'm just gonna go back and pick up everything that we didn't get the first time, or that we should have gotten, like the like the shotgun, any ammo that we might have missed. Because at this point in time, Jack can't hurt us anymore. Because he's dead, supposedly. So we can explore up here. And if you guys missed all of that, part 2 will be in the description below. that already here's the broken shotgun and I guess this tells you the location of all the different uh, dog heads but we already knew where they were at so no need for that right Ooh, no. Dear Mrs. Baker, how have you been feeling recently? It's been a long time since you came in for your last checkup. I'm writing to tell you that I finished examining your x-rays. Those dark areas in your cranium are fungus-like structures that seem to be related to mold. The, hall the hallucinations and noises you said you've been hearing may be related to these growths. If your symptoms are due to a fungal parasite, it must be removed before it's too late. I don't mean to scare you, but I'm seriously concerned for your health. Please come to the hospital as soon as you read this letter. As your doctor, I strongly recommend you undergo further tests. Crawford Lang, Dolby General Hospital. Alright, so it looks like Mrs. Baker. Alright, so it looks like Marguerite. Maybe Marguerite? Marguerite Baker. She went to the doctor with some uh, concerns. Probably around the time that they discovered the ship and started this whole mess. And it looks like she has been infected by something. The whole family for that matter. And let's go. Let's progress. Go on outside. Last head in. And we're out here now. So you're probably wondering why I stuck with the broken shotgun and not the the normal shotgun that's, you know, hanging in the middle of the hallway. 
So the reason for that is because the broken shotgun, you can get a repair kit out here and actually fix it. So you'll have a slightly stronger shotgun. I believe there's two weapons that you can repair. Yeah, there's two weapons that you can repair. One of them is a broken shotgun, and then there's a broken handgun that will get in like a minute or so. Just gonna get all these items out here. So there's a repair kit. Hmm. All right, repair kits. Combine that with broken shotgun and yeah. <clears throat> More herbs. Lock pick. There's an antique coin out here. Alright, I'll get that right now. But we're now headed to the trailer where Zoe told us to go to. Another Mr. Everywhere. And this is the trailer. The bakers again. It's too late for them. My body's feeling weirder and weirder. Soon I'll become like mom and dad. It's all her fault. Should I run? No, I can't. I'll, I'm dead if she finds out. That woman, she was with me as she knows something. If I had the serum, I could cure myself. I have to find out more. Alright, so. Another antique coin. Basically, this is the first part of the game. If you're not running it on New Game Plus. Where you can start spending your antique coins so you had a magnum over here which i think it needs nine antique coins uh stabilizer and more steroids i think if you've been following all the antique coins up until now you should be able to buy both of these um i unfortunately maybe it's zoe's okay i unfortunately missed the very first antique coin so I can't get the Magnum, but I could get everything else right now, if I wanted to. And, yeah. Carry that. Here's the broken handgun. It doesn't really matter which one you uh, use the repair kit on. Eventually, you'll have two repair kits. So you can actually repair both if you want to. Is it going to help me get out of here? Yes. Now listen carefully, Ethan. My family and I... Our bodies are contaminated. I can't leave the property unless I get it out. And the same goes for Mia. Is there a way to get it out? We need the serum. It should clear whatever this stuff is out of the body. Mm. As long as you're not too far gone. All right. So where is it? If I knew where one was, I'd already be long gone. But I have a feeling my mother has hidden some inside the old house somewhere. So if we get this thing, I can help me and we can get out of here? Right. And so can mm. I. The old house is near the water. You can't miss it. All right. I just hope you can handle my mother. Your mother? Be careful. They'll be looking for you. 
All right, so pretty shortly we're going to be headed into the third part of the game here, or the third location, which is the old house. So we just left the main house. Uh, when we initially met Mia, I think that was like their summer house or something like that, their guest house. I forget what they call it exactly. But yeah, let's use both of, both of these things. And... Yeah, I think that's all for now, so let's go ahead. I think this is the right way. Yeah, it is. Okay. So this was basically the start of uh, Mia's tape that we saw in part two. Creepy dolls. Oof. Oh God, why? Okay. Now the thing is, Margar Marguerite is probably in here, right? Not exactly sure where I'm supposed. Uh, no. Let's let's go to the right first. <laughs> okay, so there's. Flamethrower map. February 8th, 1802. Jesus. This house is old. Alright, let's not go to the right. Because I think, if I remember correctly, we just kind of have to run past, past these guys. Oh my god, how did y'all touch? Oh my god. Bruh. Nothing. Okay, so the statue here is missing. And... Camp fluid... Shotgun shells. I swear there was a part of the flamethrower here. Oh, it's right here. The burner grip. So that's part one that you need. Now you gotta find part two. And there's a safe room here, so. Another mister everywhere. And the backpack. Get more inventory storage and let's see what can we deposit if anything and i'll just go ahead and save real quick because we haven't saved in a while so not trying to die So we got part, wait, did we get everything? Yes, okay, cool. So we got everything, now we gotta find the second part of the flamethrower or the burner. 
as they call it. Oh my god! What did I just get? Solid fuel? Okay. Oh god. Hello? <laughs> Some gunpowder here, and let's see what's on the other side. Psycho stimulants and a lockpick, okay. So we got the second part of the burner nozzle here, so let's combine them. Alright, and what we gotta do now is find more uh, burner fuel here. So I don't think 150 is gonna cut it. Oh my god, what? Jesus Christ. We got bamboozled. Scare the crap out of me. Oh. Okay, so we can make more fuel by combining that and that. Cool. We got some magnum rounds. And our cycle stimulants has ended. Okay, good, more solid fuel. Uh, we'll get that, take that, combine that. All right, cool. Oh, this little guy right here. So there's a Mr. Everywhere there and an antique coin. 
No more bullshit, Mia. I want some answers. I know. I know. You're right. And I always wanted to tell you. But... But I just... I can only remember a little and the rest is just gone. Daddy, right? You mind if I, uh, borrow Bobby for a little bit? Why don't you stand there? Do something! Ethan, help! Yeah, do something. Damn it. Is there anything else in here that we can take? Guess not. Anyways, we got the statue. So we can go back into the room. Where uh, Mia was held captive. Alright, let's, let's continue here. So we got the statue, so now we can go back... To said room. Yay, the fuck out! All right, Marguerite. Jeez. Yet. <laughs> She's going through it, man. Why would you open that? Why would you do that? <laughs> oh no, I forgot about these. Yikes, 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 yikes. Alright. Yeah, so the main reason why I shot Marguerite is because I think she would she would have just kept going forward. I kinda need her to come back this way. Just so I can uh, get to this room here. And we can progress. Oh god. Uh, if you hate bugs, please look away. For like the next 20 seconds. I will do so as well. Fuck, 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 fuck! Jesus, fuck! All right, you can look back. So we're back to the same spot that Mia was at. Um, okay, looks like there's a door here with a crow. Zoe, you tried to sneak up to the second floor again, didn't you? Did you think I wouldn't notice? Even after what happened to Evelyn, you just keep talking about some strange medicine. What are you planning to do with my altar? You better keep those sticky fingers off of it. Nobody touches my sac sacred altar. You think your father and I are idiots? You spoiled pathetic child. I wish you'd never been born. Unforgivably pathetic, yet always looking down on us and trying to leave our home. After everything we've done for you, pathetic, 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 blah, 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 blah. If you ever even touch my altar, I'll slice off your chest and serve it up as pot roast. Strong words there. Strong words indeed. And is there anything here? Yeah, so we're basically using Zoe's video as a guide. Cause, um, oh god. Because if you recall from her perspective, you pretty much witnessed or saw like where all the parts were at 
like this, like the crank. Unfortunately, we have to keep making health items here, so more camp fluid. Not enough room. Whatever, we'll just make enhanced ammo. Get that crank. Is that everything? Yeah, cool. So now we have the crank that we need, so... And random bugs just start spawning in. There's one up here. Oh my god, what? So now we got the drawbridge up, so we don't have to keep going uh, back and forth, you know, running around in circles. Now, really quick, how do I open my map? I hate, look, I hate everything. <laughs> okay, so we're here. We have to go out into the dining room. Some more burner fuel. Good thing we had that on, right? She's right there. can kind of see her lantern her light as she calls it another one okay so we're down to our last of our burner fuel here it's okay though Jesus Christ, she scares me. Okay, so if we use that. If we take that. What is that? Antique coin. We can go ahead and equip that, reload that, and voila, croaky. So 
everything in here, right? Alright, so now we just have to run past Marguerite again. She's right there. You can see her through the window. Alright, she's gone. Get her attention again. Pay attention, boy. I wanna show you something. How do I oh, left trigger in a while? I told you to stay Jesus out of Christ. Here. How y'all doing? Come on. Look at me. Switch back to regular ammo here. Alright, now we can progress through this door here. We read this, right? Yeah. What the? Target acquired. Regarding the series serum, the following items be able to synthesize serum, a D-series cranial nerve and a D-series peripheral, 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 peripheral nerve. Jesus Christ, I'm a bio major and I couldn't pronounce it, wow. I think that's it. <laughs> so you need a head and an arm, right? I hear a phone, oh. I just got done dealing with your mom and her fucking bugs. Wish you could have warned me. <laughs> Sorry about that. What about the serum? I haven't found any. But I did find out we need to make one. A D-series head and an arm. This can't be right. A head? I think I have that around here somewhere. You do? I don't know about the arm, though. Have you searched the whole house? No, not yet. I still need to check the second floor here. Alright. Check it out. Meet me at the trailer if you find it. Alright. One step closer to getting that serum here. October 11th. My ears have been ringing all day and I've been able to sleep since the child sh showed up. It's like Zoe says, there's something strange about the child and the woman she brought with her next day or four days later i'm seeing things hearing things can't stop feeling nauseous i went to the doctor in town and he gave me an x-ray what's happening to me the child gave me a present on october 23rd october put the present in the secret room right at the back of the second floor where nobody will find it that arm is a sign of the child's trust that arm will lead us to happiness and anyone who corrupts that happiness i want to allow them to live okay so that's the part that we need what is that Looks like a mummified rat. Like a calcified rat. That ain't creepy at all. Alright, so we got all that stuff.
There's a mister everywhere somewhere. Oh, he's right here. Alright, so we need the lamp from Marguerite. Let's go see if we can get that from her real quick. It's not messed up at all. Oh god. What the fuck? Well, that's special. <clears throat> yeah, it's something that no one wanted to see. It's not creepy at all. Alright, before we even go in there, let me see if I can go back to the trailer real quick, just so I can uh, empty out my inventory here. Shotgun ammo. Alright, more than likely we're going to be fighting Marguerite soon, so I'm going to prep for that. We don't need the Magnum ammo because we don't have a Magnum. Alright, let me get these items real quick. That. And this. Any gunpowder? All right, so I guess now we can go ahead and face Marguerite. Let's go do that.
Alright, so y'all probably heard Marguerite down here, which is, uh, not something I like hearing. Enhanced ammo on that. Alright, so. Let's do it. I'm a little nervous, I'm not gonna lie. Oh my god. Don't you worry, none! Oops. Crusty looking woman. Ah! Ah! Jesus! Oh, let go of me! What I do to you, lady? She behind me? How y'all doing? Hey, come back. Come back, ma'am. Yo. What's good? <laughs> All right. Oh, snap, crack, pop. Ah! Don't run. Don't charge at me, ma'am. Oh, what is that? It's like the exorcism right here. Woo! Let's go. I missed. Ah! Jesus Christ, man. Come on, come on, come on, Ethan. <laughs> oh no, she pooted. She put a nest out. Damn it. Ah! How you doing? She's behind me, isn't she? Oh no, she's not.
All right, Marguerite, where you at? Hey, now. Stop doing that, man. For your own safety, please. She dead? My god. She just got exercised, bro. Well, while she's doing that... Go ahead and... Uh, fucking stay dead, okay? <laughs> you tell her, Ethan. Just gonna go ahead and scavenge around here real quick. See what we can get, because we depleted a lot of resources. Got the lantern. Pretty much didn't even go up to the second floor that often. More burner fuel, good. Let's reload. Take that, yeah. Burner fuel. I don't know what that was. Now the now the real question is how do I get out of here? Cuz I came through here, I came through that hole. I just fell through that hole. Or a hole. Okay. So that was our fight with Marguerite. I think that's gonna do it for this part here. Pretty eventful, a little bit longer than usual, but I just didn't want to end the part without encountering the next boss, right? So, Marguerite's dead. Next time we're going to go ahead and open up that door that she was guarding so much, right? So, that's going to do it for me. Thank you all so much for watching. Thank you all for tuning in. Really appreciate it. If you did enjoy this video, make sure to leave a like down below and stay tuned for part four. And as always, take care and we'll see you next time.